All right, so there are benefits to multiple different grips. So there's the traditional grip. Usually when I get a grip like this, that means I'm gonna drive my head across. My only issue with this grip, especially when we're doing jujitsu, is I still oftentimes am not really tight with my arms or my neck, right? But when I'm here, I feel like I'm just a lot tighter and I have control of his hips, meaning if he starts to sprawl, it's very easy for me to start to cut the corner. I've got control of both of his hips, it's very easy for me to start to crack them down and pin his hips in the mat. So the, the, when I lock my hands under the butt, if I find it's very, it's a lot easier for me to actually pin his hips to the mat. When my hands are behind the hamstrings, it's a lot easier for me to get up and drive. The only issue I find with trying to get up and drive, especially if you're not very experienced, is there's like this, yeah, there's this like two seconds of either you're gonna get choked or you're not gonna get choked. And like the worse you are, the higher the chances that you're either gonna get kimura or choked. So I like to lock underneath the butt because he can't kimura you and you're so tight that it's very hard for someone to actually guillotine you. So it's like, I'm actually, if I'm in here and he tries to guillotine me, it's very hard, right? Now, whereas I'm here, it's not as hard, okay? Yeah, I have more drive power means, which means like I have more power to just get up and run when I'm here. But we're doing jujitsu, so I wanna be tight, cause now if he tries to guillotine me, he, he can't really do it. And usually when he starts to guillotine, he's starting to go down to the ground, right? He's giving up top position. It's much easier for me to like follow him up. The benefit of locking underneath the butt is I really have good control of his hips. I don't have as much ability to drive up but usually, especially in our circumstance, the guy's either trying to sprawl, kimura, or guillotine, right? So I wanna do this to control his hips. When I'm underneath the knees, it gives me the ability to pick him up and drive across and chop more.